What's up guys? Oh my God. So I was doing my thing, driving. I was kind of like cruising. I was like, I need to get out of the house, drive a little, listening to music in my happy mood. And then I was like, okay, I need to stop by the dollar store because I have um, my pantry that I'm reorganizing and making it look very bougie. So I was just like, okay, I need to stop by the dollar store. I rolled up my windows, get off my car. And I'm like, fuck, where is my mask? Thank God I have a box of masks in my trunk. But I was just like ready. Like nothing happened. Like my mentality was like, okay, I'm going to walk in the dollar store like nothing, do my thing. I'm like, damn, I got to wear a mask. I, I get it, guys. I'm not complaining that I have to wear a mask because there's a lot of dirty bitches out there that don't take care of themselves and expose themselves to literally the world and i'm okay with that even prior to covid i was that bitch stay away from me don't talk to me don't breathe in my face don't touch me i was that bitch so i'm okay wearing a mask when inside a public establishment when i'm in my car minding my business and i see other people wearing their mask literally they have their windows rolled up they're wearing a mask. I'm like, girl, really? I look at them like, really, girl? To each its own. I'm not judging, but I'm not going to be wearing a mask while I'm in my bands. I'm not going to be wearing a mask, okay? Like, if I'm driving, and I'm driving my bands, and I got my music in a nice level, and I'm cruising, I want people to look at me. I want people to check me out, even though... I cannot get off my car and start flirting with people. I'm going to be that bitch driving my Benz. Driving like no tomorrow. Like, hey, I got nothing better to do than drive this Benz. I'm that bitch. But, um, is this bitch waiting for my parking space? Anyway, guys. Um, yeah, so I did my purchase. And I'm in a really good mood right now. I think I'm going to be meeting up my friend Maria. And she got a new vehicle as well. And I also need to check it out. She got a nice BMW SUV. So I'm super excited to check out her new ride. And we're just going to be chilling. I don't know for a fact if it's 100% for sure. She wanted to do something. So I'm going to call her and see what's up. Maybe I can head her way. I don't know. But today I'm just cruising and just having fun. You know, I look cute today. I did my hair. I did my skin routine. I am good to go. I got my shades. Oh my God, this is my do not talk to me shades. Like, yeah, what's up? What's up? Only thing I need to fucking get rid of is my double chin because it's growing up again. For real, guys, like right before quarantine, it was literally gone. And I would quarantine and all this shit, it came back. So I need to do something about it. I need to do a detox and get back on fitness, do my treadmill, do a little crash diet. I don't know if a crash diet will work, but do a diet for sure. Even though, oh, I was so craving McDonald's today, but I don't think I'm going to do it. I wanted to get a fish sandwich with fries. But I know for a fact that as soon as I finish eating that, I'm going to feel like shit. I'm going to feel so miserable. And I'm going to feel so fucking like Obi's like 500 pounds. And I'm not going to do it. Not today. Not today. I'm in a good mood today. Oh, so anyway, um, we're going to do a little cruising and just kind of like chill for a bit. And um, of course, I'm going to bring you guys along. So let's go for a ride in my car. Let's go for a ride. Oh, talking about singing. Guys, my um, summer single, Lockdown, has officially been approved by my label. Lockdown will be available worldwide. Guys. I mean it when I say I need my caffeine or else I am gonna snap. 
So I'm waiting patiently at the drive through line at Dunkin' Donuts for my two shots of espresso with a splash of almond milk. I get to the window and this moody woman comes out and she's like 710. And I'm like, 710? I was like, for what? You know, $7.10 for two shots of espresso and five munchkins at Dunkin' Donuts, 710. Not that I'm complaining or anything like that. I was just curious. I was just like, why is it $7.10 when I've gotten plenty of time shots of espresso at Starbucks and it was nothing more than five dollars or less so she's like well it's a dollar per shot of espresso i said okay and i have two and then she said it's 75 cents more for the almond milk i said okay that's 75 cents i said that's two dollars and 75 cents and then um she was like it's a dollar for the munchkins i said okay that's three dollars and 75 cents and then she said, a dollar for the cup. I was like, excuse me? I said, even though you shouldn't be charging me for a cup because I'm getting coffee, it's still not $7. And she's like, well, that's how much is it? I'm like, it's still not $7. I said, first of all, do you see the logistics in here. I said, you are charging me $7.10 for two shots of espresso. And then she's like, well, we don't have anywhere to put the shots of espresso in, so we have to charge you for the cup. I said, listen, keep your espresso shots. I said, change that attitude. And I'm sorry, I had to say something because she was so stupid, so stupid. This is the reason why I don't do Dunkin' Donuts and not that I'm trying to put people down or anything like that because don't get me wrong, there's times that, you know, Dunkin' Donuts makes really good coffee. But when you get stupid people like that that are interacting with the public that do not know what the fuck they're doing, girl. But it's just so crazy how dumb some people can be. And again, I'm not bashing anyone. I just hate stupid people. I hate people that don't know how to freaking solve an issue, that don't know common sense. That stuff pisses me off so much. Hey guys, all right, so I got my two shots of espresso. Guys, this was $2.25. Two shots of espresso, guys, with a splash of coconut milk, and the barista was extremely friendly. I got my two shots of espresso really quickly. Everything smooth, a la carte attitude. This is what I like. This is the reason why I like Starbucks. Yes, I don't mind paying seven dollars for a drink, but if this same drink is cheaper at Starbucks and this bitch wanted to charge me seven dollars and ten cents for the same thing I'm like bitch something is wrong with you you're fucked up in the head seriously mm. but I got my two shots of espresso from Starbucks if you guys know me you guys know that I'm a Starbucks boy I'm okay this is what I wanted okay this is what makes me happy Happy birthday, girl! Oh, thank you. Thank you. Homemade oh, cheesecake, guys. Jay, say happy birthday, too. I did. Made by Kala, <laughs> aka Latanka. Latanka. Oh, they don't know about Latanka. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready? Are you ready, Jay? Come on. It is like okay. Ready? Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. you. Happy <laughs> birthday <laughs> to you. Happy <laughs> birthday, <laughs> dear Lizzy. Happy <laughs> birthday. <laughs> Stand the rain. <laughs>
Choo 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 choo. It's my window. I can't stand the rain. Choo choo choo. Me and my superstar. Super super superstar. All right, guys. I'm here at Palas, about to get this hairdo because I look like a crackhead. Ooh, I do look like a crackhead girl. Ooh. Okay, girl. Anyway, um, you guys see how the side is brown, and then on top it's kind of like blonde now. Well, it used to be like gray because. When I dye my hair last week, it just turned out gray. So, gotta get all glam, guys. Oh, I love Bob Mark. Oh, no. Oh, he didn't try to school ya. Oh, that's a jam. Yes, I love Bob Mark. I'm gonna be blonde again, bitches. Did you miss me? Look, guys. I am a blonde again, thanks to my girl Paula, <laughs> aka Latonka, Latonka Leaks. Yeah. And, um, ooh, it burns a little, but not that bad, actually. I think my scalp is getting used to it now. I think my scalp is like, bitch, I missed you. Okay. I miss you. I think I want to do something on the eyebrows, girl. You think? Oh, child. Or should we just do the Madonna? Why did you do the Madonna? Yeah, you think? Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to keep it like that at least. Because oh. what's going to happen is you're going to end up turning, once they grow out, then what? You got to worry about plucking them all the time. That is true. You're right. Okay, we're good here. We're good. So now I'm gonna cap you. Okay. And then I'll use that for a touch up. Sounds like a plan. All right, guys. It is officially my birthday. Happy birthday, Rodimus. It is 12 15. Yes. And look at my hair, guys. It looks so bougie. I am back being a blonde. I love it. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this vlog. As always, if you guys are not subscribed to the channel, make sure you guys do so. And I will see you guys in the next vlog. Bye. Happy birthday.